Hey, how's it going? Going all right here. Well, a friend of mine whom I've known for many, many years, uh, our friendship started on forums, but then I also got to meet her in person, and, and she's cool. But she and I got into an argument on Facebook. It was in private messages. Um, we were talking about a number of things, but at some point it, it devolved into the subject of consistency. And we were, in, we were talking past each other. I was using the word consistency in regard to someone's current positions. I say that it's very important for someone to be consistent in their positions. And she was arguing against consistency because she was using it, the word, in regard to someone's position over a period of time. Now, I don't know why anyone would try to argue that it's important to be consistent over a period of time. I mean... You might hope that someone is consistent, let's say if they're a politician, that, you know, you voted for them because they had these positions and you hope that they'll keep those positions as they're in office, but it's still not even a realistic thing to, to hope that on, on anyone. You know, if, if there's someone who won't change their positions because they're, no, I, I'm a Christian and so I'm, I'm only going to have these positions, yeah, that's kind of sad. And so, you know, I was saying, you know, it's important to have some, be consistent on your current positions. And she was saying, she left this quote saying, consistency is the hobgoblin of little minds. And I was appalled in, at what she was saying, and she was appalled at what I was saying. And, uh, you know, I understand what she was saying now, but I don't think she saw my most recent messages to her saying, hey, no, I'm, t I'm talking about someone's current position. I mean, she was arguing that, hey, you you change your position all the time. And I'm like, yeah, because I, I want to be have consistent positions. You know, I get an I get a new piece of information. I'm going to change my views. And I have to re every time that happens, I get a new piece of information. I have to recompile that with everything else in, 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 in the rest of my mindset. I have to take put that fact and check it against everything else in my mind. You know, I feel that's very important. Um, but uh, she never, I don't think she ever understood. But the reason why I'm making this video is just to ask, if someone talks about being consistent on their positions, do you think of being consistent over a period of time, or do you think being consistent at the current time? I mean, uh, I, I, some of why I'm even asking about this is, you know, I was questioning whether I was using the word consistent in a way that most people use it. You know, I think about people who call themselves pro-life. Oftentimes, I mean, to me, many pro-lifers are inconsistent. They'll say they're pro-life, but when you dig at it, it, they're showing that they're really only pro-life when it comes to unborn children. And as soon as they're born, they suddenly don't care anymore. Oh, who cares? And then I think about another example, um, kind of going the opposite way, um, of when someone was saying, oh, I'm, I'm against a children's show, a young children's show depicting a gay marriage. And then when I probe them for long enough, they, they say, well, I'm, I'm against uh, a young children's show showing any marriage. And then my comment to them is, well, at least you're consistent. And so I was wondering, you know, have I, have I, been, have I been using that word incorrectly? But I don't think I have. But, you know, how do you feel about it? Let me know in comments, you know, when you hear the word consistent, do you think over a period of time or do you think at the current time? Let me know. Thanks.